One of the ways that people are able to manage their pain is by using the spinal cord stimulator. And as a psychologist, I have two main roles in that intervention. One is from an insurance compliance standpoint. Many insurance policies and insurance companies require that a patient see a psychologist prior to the spinal cord stimulator being installed. That's one reason. The second reason is just as important, which is from a clinical standpoint. It's important that people understand what they're getting into as far as not only the stimulator, but also how it's going to help them with their symptoms, but also with their psychological health, with their mood, if they're having depression or anxiety or severe pain. We help them manage their expectations, address their symptoms, and also work closely with the neurosurgeons to make sure that everything is working the way it should be.